right, going to the phones is Stephanie from Minnesota. Hey, Stephanie, welcome to the show. Hi, thanks for taking my call. Absolutely. How can we help? Well, my husband and I, we are working on baby step number two. Um, I'm a stay-at-home mom, so what you guys were just talking about really kind of um, resonates with me. Um, we're doing our budget. We got that all figured out, you know, rice and beans. Um, but it still just doesn't feel like enough. And I'm trying to figure out if I should go back to work, if I should just do side hustles, you know, what I can do to help contribute to getting rid of that debt. Yeah, that's a great question. And I feel like there's a lot of women that are exactly in your in your spot. We hear this question a lot. And so, Chrissy, you actually help a lot with women and, and getting kind of a side hustle going to make extra money, not, not only to do it for their passion and their gifts, but also to bring in some extra income. Yeah, Stephanie, first, I just want to say well done because there's a value on the fact that you're staying home with mm-hmm. your kids. There, there's a value in that child care. <laughs> child care is expensive and your work at home is not you just sitting around. I know and it's so not. so are maids and valet right. and chefs, everything right. that you do. <laughs> there's, a, there's, a va- there's a value on what you do. So please don't feel like I'm not contributing enough because I'm not working outside the home. You are working inside the home and there's a value on what you're saving your family and child care costs. So I want to start with that baseline of you already are bringing in money for the family by doing that. Now, if you want to uh, contribute a little bit more or in a different way, you use your gifts, have some you know side hustle, Um, it's easier than ever before to do that. And what I teach people to do that may just be a good starting point to explore for you is to start with Mm -hmm. what you have, your skills, your strengths, and your stuff. And when you start with what you have and coming up with an idea for a side hustle or a home-based business, it makes it so easy on you to win quickly and to turn a profit quickly and to have income coming in because it's not this uh, scary thing that you have to go learn a new skill and buy a bunch of stuff. You're just going to look around you. What am I good at? What do I have experience in? What am I naturally talented at? What stuff? I've got a sewing machine. Maybe I can sew. I've got a swimming pool. Maybe I can teach swim lessons. I've got a computer. Maybe I can write. You know, when you look around you with what you already have, you make it so much easier on you to win and become successful and bring in money faster. And then it builds your confidence. It's more fun. And as a side note, you're also making more money. So if you want to explore that in addition to the value you're already bringing to the table in your family for baby step two, then I would encourage you to do that. And Stephanie, I would love to also send you a copy of my book, Business Boutique, and that is a plan to start a business. So should you decide to do that at any level, even if you just want to make an extra $500 a year, it's going to help you do that. I love helping people get started. And so if you'll stay on the phone, we'll we'll send you a copy of that. But I think you see this a lot, Rachel, with baby step two. People want to bring in more money faster because they're so motivated. And that's a good thing. That's a really good thing. Absolutely, for sure. But I love that we don't discount the fact because people get out of debt all the time and the wife stays at home and that's what, and that's her job. That's what she does. That's what she focuses on because there is something to be said that there's a peace of mind, right? When the husband comes home from work and you're there and you're, you're helping out and you're doing, you know, what you do at home. I'm like, that's powerful. And there's something expensive. there. Yes. <laughs> oh gosh. So there's plenty of people in America, Stephanie, that are getting out of debt on one income. So don't lose hope on that. Don't think it's impossible. But if there is something that you have, they're like, man, I really could do this. And, and it'd be fun. I would enjoy it while the kids are in school and all of that. Then that definitely is an option. But don't, again, discount, um, discount being home because that is such, such a gift that you're giving your family for sure.